Floyd County Productions, this is Entertainment Magic. And they've made this season of Always Sunny in Philadelphia especially magical. Now grab a cup of coffee and sit back and learn how cartoons are made. Once a story and a script have been finalized, the animation begins here in the animation studio. Here, highly trained artists called storyboardisters lay out the initial plan for the action of the animation, block by block and scene by scene. This process is called doing the storyboards. Meanwhile, several other highly trained artists begin the process of character designing. Using high-tech electronics, our super smart computer will take Claire here's silly little doodles and turn them into a virtual puppet. Isn't that right, Claire? Ha ha ha! Adorable. As Claire wraps up her monkey scribbles, another team of artists begin artwork on backgrounds. While extremely important, this process is exceptionally boring. Sorry, Katie. Before you know it, the storyboard work is approved and passed to an editor of immigrant descent. The editor will painstakingly assemble the frames in what's called a time row. Sure beats selling oranges and or drugs on freeway off-ramps, doesn't it, Pierre? <laughs> he mustn't understand English. Up to 10 minutes later, the team collaborates again and agrees on the final storyboard edit, now called an animatic. The animatic is divided up among an army of nameless, faceless animators who are tasked with bringing the cartoon to life. Looks fun, huh folks? Finally, the individually finished scenes are sent back to the swarthy editor, who replaces the still and placid storyboard frames with exciting animation. Let's watch a little, shall we? guys. And that's how cartoons are made. As read by me, Artemis.